the United Shoestring Broadcast Service, the DMP Soul Hama Radio TV Show Live at Refuge, the Premier Warehouse Theater, Portland, Oregon, present DMP's remake of H.G. Wells' The War of the Worlds. The Balinese Affair. This is an NBC News special report. Ladies and gentlemen, the director of the United Shoestring Broadcasting System and star of this broadcast, the Diepi Soul Hama. We are living in, and many of us watching this broadcast, a part of a Diepi Soul Hama experiment. A lot of them have collapsed. Some that were built after that have uh, resisted. It's pretty resistant. What caught my attention is that the new construction has, has, has been the one with the most damages. An experiment with many unknown causes, and yet, I think, unknown scale. I don't know if we're on the air. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Deanna Sosa with the KRQE News 13 News Center. We do have some breaking news for right now. There the effects being watched as human beings are greater than one man alone. Laymen and our radio television audience are no longer in control of their serene occurrence as human beings. That's the greatest open in the history of television. We are being urged to leave the area, get with family and friends, and work back. And then group three, of course. Communication capabilities of officials to address the public while humans busy themselves with their various day-to-day -day activities will become more and more intense as problems in affairs of the real world outside develop. And for you to dissect for yourself, the real world inside events progress in this broadcast. These various day-to-day -day movements and concerns will be scrutinized and studied intensively. More essential cars, take what you need, and those are essentials like medications and your pets and important documents. And here's how it's going to work. Now, you're going to be asked to get that 911 reverse call. Residents in Los Alamos in the downtown North community came as well. Proceed with caution. In the 11th year of the 21st century came the great disillusion. Me, me. I can't believe! What the fuck? This glove is an insane glove. I could touch anything. <laughs> it was near the end of October. Global economies were in a slump. The war scare was soon to be over. Unemployment remains high. Retail sales were slow. On this particular evening, October 21st, the no-name rating service estimated that 45 million people were watching and listening in on television and radios to the D'Ampi Soul Hama Show. Actually start fucking representing the American people. Okay. God, you know, I'm on the talk. I was the American. Yeah, me too. Oh, okay. I thought so. I have freedom of the press, right? First Amendment, freedom of the press. You guys can set up a camera on a public sidewalk last night, last night, look. Okay, cool. Right? Keep on going. I can stand here while you guys keep on filming. Go ahead. Why do you hide your face? Can I ask you why you hide your face? Because you guys keep on dropping bombs on people, killing, killing people. I do. I drop a bomb. Why are you supporting the same people? Right. I'm not supporting those people. Oh, you're not? No. I bet you're a fucking liar, too, bro. A weather forecast of snow flurries, mostly on increase today, causing high pressure to hit the area and to remain breezy across the region, dropping windshield readings to nearly 20 below. It's absolutely 
It's absolutely pathetic, bro. I'm serious. It's it's so fucking lame that we gotta sit there and see you asses on TV every fucking day. Mark and we're fucking sick of it. Oh, we'll John Mark argued that people were born without any rights. ideas but to our experiences we see in the shit. world. Fucking sick of you assholes. Every fucking day we gotta see this shit on the TV, and everybody's sick of it, bro. Trust me. This is one form of ESP, perception without whatever. sensory input. Beyond the square, beyond any fucking square, you guys are a bunch this of report fucking comes to you from the United Weather Bureau, Bureau and the National Bureau of State country. Propaganda. Fucking we fucking do the real thing, and we don't want any violence, and we continue this to say that. This is one form of ESP, ESP perception without sensory more input. More bullshit. Every fucking day, we gotta sit here and live with it. We're tired of it, bro, and we're fucking real. <laughs> We now take you to Refuge, the premier warehouse theater, 116 Southeast Yam Hill Road, Portland, Oregon. This report includes graphic content. This report includes viewers and listeners from Refuge Warehouse, Portland, Oregon, we bring you the live music of Blackalicious and Lyrics Born. and lyrics born at refuge who bring you a special this report from the DMP radio television united shoestring broadcast service this just in back to you live in the studio Half past the hour, Pacific Standard Time, economics professor A.J. Roma from the University of New York reports his analysis of several global monetary catastrophes indicating a severe global <laughs> meltdown. Stop making me laugh. I'll Beware. Professor Austin White of the University of Pensacola in Florida confirms Roma's reports and made the following recommendation. Help us! They don't want to do this! in their fucking yards! They aren't in here, and they are not in our country! They are not American! Get them the fuck out of here! Get them the fuck out of here! This is ours! This is Liberty Plaza! I would recommend stocking up on emergency supplies, water, duct tape, non-perishable food, drugs, first aid supplies, like, uh, tools, the, generators, gasoline, uh, and of course, street, firearms. That some of the some of the streets actually collapse in themselves. How are communications in the region of Bio Bio? We it's taken us six hours to be able to get in touch with with you. What's going on with cell phones? What's going on with phones? We now bring you back to your Diampi <laughs> Radio Television United Shoestring programming already in progress. Days, baby. It's like two thousand what nine? It's December the what? The twenty fourth. It's Christmas Eve, dog. Here with the electric circus. 
<laughs> Sunny Sullivan Electric Circus CTV, baby. Live and direct from Vegas, 2009. Peace. Oh my God! Ah! My God! Please, me, help me! I can't believe! What the fuck? This glove is an insane glove. I can touch anything. Ooh. I need that goddamn fucking glove, Nick. Three. <laughs> What do you mean? Look at the fucking shit that fucking like 400 degrees. It was on 400 degrees? Yeah. 450. Ladies and gentlemen, following the news in our special report just a moment ago, that the Anthony Radio Television United Shoestring Broadcast Service has requested that many college and universities throughout the United States keep track of the nation's economic crisis as conditions unfold. <laughs> Due to the unusual nature of these occurrences, we have arranged an interview with the noted economic professor A.J. Roma, who will give you his views of these events as they happen. In a few moments, we'll take you to the University of New York, Professor A.J. Roma. Until then, we will return you to your program already in progress. Here I am. I'm back. I was a disappeared person, but I just uh, reappeared again. <laughs> and now we're on the BMP show. <laughs> sí, uh, lo que pasa es que uh, yo sé el idioma, pero prefiero, como es mi primera vez, prefiero hacerlo en eh, con un traductor. Spanish is his first language, and since it's his first time giving a testimony, he would rather do it in Spanish. It's insulting to us. Thank you. It's very insulting. And if he, needs, if he knows English, he needs to be speaking in English. Ladies and gentlemen, I must interrupt this broadcast where the DMPU Radio Television United Shoestring Broadcast Service is now ready to take you to the University of New York. Professor A.J. Romo will now give you his live financial analysis. All right, you're listening to KWVA Eugene. We're doing a little transition here. This is the Reverend Mark Time. You've been listening to the D. Ampi Soul Hama Show here on KWVA Eugene. Giving uh, D. Ampi a few minutes to get uh, set up over there. We're going to be doing some monitoring of the Sunday morning hangover show, which is coming up in a minute. And uh, hope you'll bear with the changes. Hey, how's it going? What's going on, man? Not much. Just uh, thought I'd give you a call. Uh, sit here rolling for a meeting appointment. I've been missing the next for the last couple of weeks. So I decided to see how you're doing, call you with a little uh, forecast. You know, I just got tired of calling you guys. You guys are so academia. All you guys, once you get your freaking masters and PhDs, you're just so academia. All y'all came from the streets, and all of a sudden now you're all academia. You don't want to talk to a, you don't want to talk to a, <laughs> you know, a layman. It's all good. How you doing in Miami? How many people signed up for your class down there at the University of Miami? A few, you know. Uh, I teach. I teach. Uh, I'm more of a more of a non a non-traditionalist economist. Uh, in today's theories of Keynesian e economics and neoliberalism, economic theory that is actually cracking our like whole economic system right now through this false separation of. Uh, Proliferation of uh, the money system, you know. Uh, reading today, there's another bank that just crashed in uh, in Georgia. Yeah, so that uh, makes it like uh, about the ten bank this year to crash, and the FDIC is seeking money from the Treasury because they don't have enough money to secure the loans or secure the uh, deposits that are being made each day by the American people. Hello. So when the civil defense sirens will Hello. go off, and uh, civil defense is urging everyone here in the Hawaiian Islands to use uh, phones sparingly, only in emergency purposes, because they will need all of uh, those resources to get these evacuations underway at 6 a.m. with the possible threat of this tsunami uh, striking just uh, about four and a half hours later at 11:19 is when that first potentially destructive wave is expected to hit the Hawaiian just, Islands. Just This just in, back to you live in the studio. 
Alright, I'm gonna try to retrieve my beer that I stashed. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Hello. 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 Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for going big time, bud. <laughs> I've been good there. Yeah, they, it's coming up, you know, as as a positive on their balance sheet because they're foreclosing on a home. But they're no longer able to like uh, sell it off because the economy is so bad, or they're taking a big hit, and you know, and so they're not reaping that much benefit. This is why you see that now. They're directing all the people out of town. Alright, we're going after my beer. Hopefully it's still here. I stashed a beer in this trash can. Let's see if it's still here, ladies and gentlemen. DMP exclusive. Here is the can. Alright, okay. We got our beer. It was I stashed it in this trash can right there. That's the beer. Here's the people. We're going home. Live on a D Epi Soama show. We retrieved the beer that was in the trash can. Beep. They not make it sort of that much money that banks are turning towards uh, what they call like uh, uh, overdraft of these before you actually overdraft. So if you use your ATM card and you run it as a check card and you don't have the money, normally it takes about three days for it to get processed and you get an overdraft fee. As soon as you run it, they're already going to charge you the overdraft fee and, and uh, let you allow that purchase to go through. So you don't even have time enough to be, even make it to the bank the next day and borrow money from your friend or your mother or your brother or your sister to actually pay that without getting that overdraft charge. Hello, it's the Diampe Soul Hammer Radio TV Show. Thank you for stopping by. I'll tell you everything you need to know about the show. The Diampe Soul Hammer Show. That's right. How we produce it. How you, the artist, can be a part of it. <laughs> You're watching the D.F.E. Sohoma Show. I don't Grab a pen and paper. Here's the deal. This is Sarah B. Green wishing you many environmentally friendly days ahead. The D.F.E. Sohoma Radio Show is a global, collaborative, multimedia artist forum. The D.F.E. is blessed with this opportunity to be a producer for multiple public access television and radio markets nationally by jumping through the hoops to produce, edit, and publish all artist content submitted to the show. <laughs> You <laughs> you can take a picture of me, but me and the old lady here, beer. Look into my eyes and get stoned. The DMP Soul Hama Show! This has been super fun, but it ain't been easy. The day for wonderful. Juggling five hats, publisher, producer, editor, narrator, writer, and director, all of this can be, well, you know, a pain in the ass. So ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my little triage here. What we're going to be doing today is just chopping up some footage. We're working with Adobe like CS6. Just to get this done. 
but in reality, there are many great artists from all over the globe creating some amazing art. So this is my way to work with you, the artist, because you are the show. The show. The Diampi Sohama Radio TV Show. <laughs> That's cool. Thank you. This reporting this is graphic ghetto content Merlo. your discretion is Works together. Essential to the experience of the DMP. It's all hammer show. Well, this is the ghetto Merlot. Works together. Essential to the experience this of the This report DMP. includes graphic Soul content. Of your discretion is advised. <laughs> This reporting includes graphic content and your discretion is defined. Whereby the great of God is a great thing that they do. This reporting includes graphic content and your discretion is defined. By Captain Merton, the heavy ship. Whereby the great of God is a great thing. Estando en aguas calientes we produce all kinds of art. Short movies, video reels, collages, audio and video mashups, music videos, Animations. The birds and the bees. We need to talk. What do you know about these birds and bees? What do you want to know? <laughs> Stop motion. Photography. <laughs> Script writer. Gets in the car, drives at her, hits her. I'm not kidding, lady. I'll hit you, I'll hurt you. Backs right up. Last chance. Boom! That's the way it happened. And he thinks it's her fault for not getting out of the way. And visual art. Basically, anything that is art will glow. You name it, everything. The broadcasters of your area, in voluntary cooperation with federal, state, and local authorities, have developed this system to keep you informed in the event of an emergency. If this had been an actual emergency, the attention signal you just heard would have been followed by official information, news, or instructions. This station serves the Northeast Illinois area. Overall, today we have a total of 19 mashup episodes. Yo, this is Charlie Tuna, Man Fibian MC, and you are now tuned in live from Oakland at the DMP Soul Hummet Show. P. Categorized into two seasons. I'm Professor, I'm viewing the DMP Soul Hummet Show. 12 and a half hours of completed art and content. Contributed by hundreds of artists from all over the globe. That's approximately 3,000 contributions from over 500 artists. Hey, look, my pronunciation isn't all that great, but we got D-Ambage online. Since our inception on radio and many television stations all across the United States, <laughs> you can find excerpts of the episodes called Teasers online at YouTube, Tumblr, and our webpage, D-Ambage Soul Hummer Radio. Hama. Hama Show. Show. And, and uh, the thing about that show is, it's, uh, well, Gary, you and I were watching one the other day. Tell me, what, tell me your thoughts. I mean, this, the guy's a magician, that's all I have to say. He's having three or four images going on at the same time. Uh, I like to have three vid uh, audio sources going at the same time. And if you're in the right mood, you just sit there transfix. We were over previewing some of the shows that he has coming up. And even though he uh, claims he's going to be going to... 
Thailand from Eugene, he's still going to be doing the shows, but it's it's just uh, the world still isn't ready for the D. Anthony Solhama show. What else do we do? We also yeah, produce yeah, live improv, day, research and develop clean, radio shows. <laughs> Artists, mostly musicians, show up at our studios with their instruments. CDs, tapes. <laughs> you remind me of Sammy Davis Jr. And you're watching the D Ampy Soul Hama Show. Tambourines, guitars. In the D Ampy Soul Hama Show. Poems, speeches. This poem? Yeah. All right, they're on. At first thing I want to say. And just like our television Ninja. mashup episodes, Presented. we mash up radio. These cannot be in the studio. But this is live, on air, unedited, reform radio. Artists perform. Converse. Uh, you ever been in here? Nah, oh, man, I'm actually excited. Oh, oh, this, man. this looks fresh. This, uh, this is your joint. Yeah. Rap sing. Create spontaneous live art on air, straight to our listening right, what's audience. Up, man? Hey, I'm Charlie P, man. What's Charlie up with you, dear? What's going on, man? Just down here doing the thing here in radio. So you hear me? You you hear me in the mic and in, in the earphones and everything? Yes, I do. Loud okay. and clear, sir. So this is a tester, one, two. So tell everybody who you are and what you do in uh, Pacific Northwest. Man, I'm just Charlie P, just doing that comedy thing on that stage, trying to bring that laughter to people's lives, man. That rain, bring that depression. I'm here to lift it off. I'm here to be that sunshine. Remember, the artist is the show. The show. I am but your humble host, the D'Ambe Solhama. All right, what's the name of your brand? Jamil E. Pock. Open up. What does it say? San Francisco Chronic. Okay, that's your own brand? Yeah. And how do we uh, see more of this brand? Uh, e EpochArtistRelations.com. Epoch, spell that. E P O C H. Okay, where are we at right now? Uh, SF Stadium. San Francisco, baby. There you go. And how long have you been putting these shirts? They're pretty cool, man. Yeah, a year now. Yeah? Well, yeah. Cool. It's the first season for San Francisco. Now, you know that you're going to be on public television, correct? Yeah, man. Cool. Now, I want you to say this. Three chick. A line from uh, Pat Bell Park. This is DMLP. <laughs> If you want to become a part of the experience, please let me hear from you. The Diampe Soul Hammer Radio TV Show. Hey man, so what are you doing, brother? Well, I'm trying to ban single use plastic. You gotta talk bags. louder. One, two, three, kick. What are you doing, brother? <laughs> I'm trying to ban single use plastic bags. And uh, how are you doing? How are you well, going we're about that? We're filling out postcards. We're having people sign it. The Eugene Council is going to vote on it um, in October to ban single use plastic bags. And we're turning in to, hopefully, so far we have 1,500 signatures, and we're going to hopefully have 2,000, but too many right now. Yeah? So how long you been uh, at your uh, your gamut here? I think this is my seventh week. Are you hot in that? No, not too bad. Are you press firing? The, the wind goes right I can smell it. you, man. You put on deodorant today? <laughs> I, I, you were trashing me, man. Yeah, I know. Me. That's what it looks like here. Is it? The D'Ampi Soul Hama Radio TV Show. We now bring you back to your D'Ampi Radio Television United Shoestring programming already in progress.
Mexicans at night from El Paso, Texas now. Uh, yeah, now squeeze your heads in. Oh, there you go. Now kick. One, two, three. Oh, live from Santa Monica. They're not in Santa Monica, you asshole. Live from Santa Barbara, California. It's Mexicans at night, and you're watching the DMP So Hammer Show. Yeah, baby. <laughs> you sure you in Santa Barbara? I'm in Santa Barbara. That's All right, you're not in San Diego, right? <laughs> Oh my god. Let me see what I did. Let me see what I did. Yeah. Let me set this.